Hello everyone and welcome to Wednesday. Sometimes uh, when the alarm goes off and Mal and I get up in the morning, uh, I have to go upstairs first thing because I haven't scheduled all of the stuff for Stephen Plays that day. Sometimes I'll do it the night before, or sometimes I'll do it the week before, so it's really set. But often, um, the only thing I schedule before bed is Morning Mario. So I'll schedule Morning Mario because that's at 6 and I'm not up that early. Then I'll go to bed and I'll wake up and schedule the memorable moment and the LP episode for that day. So it's all taken care of. Well, today I did that and I came downstairs. When I came downstairs, <laughs> this is what I saw. Mal's laying there and Zagan is just, so cute. just enjoying life. I mean, we gotta eat a little food. Buddy, I'm starving. And we're not going to be able to eat a little food if you have kitty on you. I mean, I didn't choose kitty life. The kitty life chose you. Mm -hmm. Sagan, hey babe. You're very sweet, but like, we, we got things to do. He's so good. We got things to do. This is easily one of the hardest parts of working from home, I think. Is that cats like come spend time with you and you don't want to turn them away. <laughs> He's a good boy. It's a little bit later and more importantly, it's chicken tendy time, which is a fun thing to say. But for Sagan, it's, it's try and get the toy that I threw into that discarded uh, trash bag box. There you go might be wondering why we have that there. And this is the box that the air fryer came in. And then we stuck the, the cooler on top because we had given it to my parents to borrow so they could put hold some it, stuff in if they need put on, to. Yeah, hold, hold on to more stuff whenever they were switching fridges. But when we had the, the air fryer box here, the cats kept trying to jump into it. And there's still some things in it that we need to pull out. Exactly, there's still some stuff in it, so we put that on that instead. And now it's now it's a new kitchen island. We love it. Anyway, um, so how, how are tendies going? I have no idea. You have no idea? I'm just about ready to start breading, so we'll see how this goes. You're doing it on a plate. That's what it said. Oh. Okay. Ooh. We getting tendy tonight! So the first batch of chicken tendies are done. They wouldn't all fit in one of the baskets, so we have to do another basket just for the remaining two. But Mal noticed something very interesting, swapping between the two. She said that the start button was really hot. Really hot. So she got out her... Laser um, thermometer? I don't know how accurate this is, but it says it's over 100. And apparently the top is cooler than the start button, and the start button's 100 degrees, so, you know... Maybe take that into consideration if you're looking at an air fryer. This is that Emerald Lagasse model, and the buttons get, um, you know, a little warm. But the real question is, how do these chicken tendies taste? And I don't know. They look like chicken tendies. I mean... It's like an oven baked chicken tender. Really? Mm hmm. So it doesn't seem fried? I mean, there's a breading on it, but it doesn't taste fried. Like. Really? Yeah. I'll try one before I sauce this up. Yeah, I, um. These are good. Mm hmm. I'd be really good with sauce, but I hate to break it to you. These aren't even really, like, remotely. I mean, you're not hurting my feelings. You can kind of see like a little bit of it on the edge, maybe. I didn't want to overcook them and dry them out because they want, I got them to temp. Oh. So. Like on the other side? Uh-huh. Where that brown was? Uh-huh. It kind of tastes like it's starting to be fried a little bit. But like, I don't know that it, like it, it 
it doesn't seem like it's fried. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Like it doesn't it doesn't really taste like it's fried at all. So I don't know. I don't know. I've uh, not really sure if we're doing something wrong or if the like the machine is not as capable or something. I'm not I'm not exactly sure, but these you know they're still good. They need to be um, they need to be dipped in sauce. As soon as they're dipped in sauce, they'll be they'll be pretty great. Anyway, that's it for today. I've been working on vlogs all day, and I still got a lot more vlogs to edit, but um, it's coming along. It's uh, it's going to be a process, but we're uh, we're working towards it. Thanks for watching, and as always, let's meet back tomorrow, shall we?